It's like a roller coaster. Oh my god. <laughs> Say it again. Oh my god. Before we get to that, let me catch you up if you're new here. Hi, I'm Andy. That's me. I was laid off a year ago and I decided it was time for a change. So I sold my house and chose to travel across North America in my Tesla for two years with my wife MC. With my mental health at an all-time low, it's time to find a new perspective and turn things around. Yeah, a bit of an overcast day, as you can see over there, maybe. <laughs> we're heading into the city and we're going to check out, I don't know what it's called, <laughs> some kind of uh, music museum. And then we're going up to the Calgary Tower and check out the views of the city. Let's go. Where are we? In a lovely parking lot. <laughs> We're going to the Studio Hall, the home of the National Music Center. Hey, but life is coming on too fast. So this is my attempt to try and fill you in on what's going on. After my last message where I explained that I was in burnout, I took several steps to try and get back on track, finally had the energy and the mental wellness to try and edit, but my hard drive was full. Fair enough, go buy a hard drive so I can dump some of my stuff off. The hard drive doesn't work because my dock isn't working, so I go and buy a dock for the new hard drive, plug everything in, still doesn't work. I'm worse off than when I started. I made no progress whatsoever. I feel absolutely terrible. <sighs> I can't see a way forward. And so, as far as I'm concerned, this is the end of the series. This is the last video I'm recording until things either get fixed or not. This is the end. I don't know. We'll see. We did a bunch of things while we were here. Yeah. Some pretty awesome stuff. What did you enjoy best? Um, <laughs> Banff. <laughs> or a day in Banff was definitely the highlight. The, oh my god, it was repeated probably a hundred times in that day. <laughs> yeah. It, that was the day that helped me reset. Mm-hmm. Because everything went well, yeah. it was 
shockingly calm over there. Yeah, which was odd for Friday. It was Friday the 13th, so... Yeah, we had really weird, spooky weather. <laughs> and maybe that scared a lot of people away. Maybe it was because it was colder. Maybe they thought it was going to rain. We did a little tour of the village, did a lot of walking, and then I insisted on renting e-bikes. <laughs> And ironically, <laughs> that was the part I enjoyed the most. I, I was really hesitant because... It's a village. It's a village. Yeah. But a busy village. Yeah. Like lots of cars. So I was hesitant <laughs> to do the bikes for that reason. Because I didn't want to deal with cars and everything else. Why do you keep all my guarding? <laughs> I'm just... I can't believe it. I'm speechless. That's all I can say. It's, oh my god. <laughs> we got out of the main core, <laughs> and then I was good. I really enjoyed it. Coming into the video. All right. <laughs> Made it to the sign. Then wait around. Yep, exactly. <laughs> we got the real shot. <laughs> and I called this my recovery place because when I got here, I was completely burnt out. This place in particular has been just so stress free and easy. It feels like home. Mm -hmm. Like, it's designed in a way similar to how I design things. It's very minimal and it helped. Our hosts were amazing. They treated us to dinner this week. We had time to spend with them and get to know them and they're just fantastic. And I think we've made friends. So <laughs> yeah. That's pretty cool. <laughs> we did science. Well, we didn't do... I mean, we kind of did science. We did. We were there, but yeah, there was a lot of hands-on. <laughs> we enjoyed science and art. I loved that they had an art exhibit there with interactive art installations. Mm. Just having a little drink. I'm thirsty. Yeah. Ooh. Delicious.
Gotta plug the channel. <laughs> Uh, stabby. <laughs> yeah, and I did my, they had those giant spinning tops. <laughs> Both MC and I are kind of feeling a little homesick, and I think it's mostly because of Marcus. <laughs> Sorry, Marcus. It's just that uh, he really made this place feel like home and feel like we had friends here. And wow, I'm getting emotional. <laughs> I had such a rough couple of weeks that it was nice. It was nice. I'm gonna cut now. Bye. Mm -hmm.